Hi guys, welcome to my days dealing with various assignment of strategic presentation and occasionally with my lab rat. So I just search for best e-portfolio and then a lot of e-portfolio showcases from a lot of colleges just pop up. Um, eventually I pick this one, Orbe University, and I have to pick one from 12 of these. I decided to go with this one eventually because I was wondering, is this his work? Is that a photograph photographer? It turns out he is photographer from Alabama. So this portfolio is kind of like the combination of this one, Mike, and this one, Kekai. I don't want to talk too much about this one because this is just really straightforward, plain old, um, portfolio that is. So the reason I say that it is a combination of this one and this one is because it has blog posts about how to do certain things that are relevant to the subjects. Like what is um, digital art? So he basically combined these pictures and then come up with this, which is pretty good, which is pretty cool. Um, it looks good too. And just like this one, it tells you how to create unique wedges area for individual posts in WordPress. It's very complicated, not things that I can read, but it's a tutorial kind of thing. So this one's to have this, he have this galleries on the home page just like uh, Dakota did. Good things about it is it's no, um, I don't know, personal component. But this picture is really nice and it makes me wonder, like, is this his work or is this himself? And I really want to look at it. So I picked this one. It's low on personal component and it's really simple. It display. Uh, the author's work and a lot of blog posts that are really relevant and cool. So in general, this is a good e-portfolio. Um, it's simple, easy to navigate, uh, display the author's work and his information. And, and there's a lot of things that you can explore through too, which is great. You can see a lot of his work straightforward this is good but there's a lot of improvement that can be done like i said the arrangement of the photograph his work it can be like this it can be more delicate and, and um, if anyone want to contact him this social thing is really small although it's not it's not not salient, it's there, you can click on, but look at these, these websites, they have their where to find me right, right there, right there. So maybe make this um, to places that you don't have to scroll. One big thing too, this nice picture of this football player that lure me in is not in this gallery. I don't know what happened, but it's a little disappointing because I'm not seeing it. But in general, it's a it's a good uh, it's a good e portfolio. I would say that my favorite would be this one. I'm simply impressed by his work. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.